This is our patient for today. Uh, young man, why don't you tell us what's going on? I uh, suffer from uh, neck injuries, back problems. Lately it's uh, been rhomboid, it bothers me. I'm all unaligned and uh, it affects every part of my body. I just turned 40. You're young! I know, but I have no strength. I mean, it's, I feel it when I pick up my five-year-old daughter now. It's like, uh, I don't know. I want to get this fixed from there down. Okay, stop. I'm going to adjust oh, you. I got to go. No worries. Cramps on me and then I'm just in pain. You s face that way. Full body. Come back towards me. We're going to put your hands behind your neck. I want you to intertwine them like that. Tuck your elbows in. Look up. Alright. I thought the spine did something. Yeah, so went. Alright, on your back, we're going to see how that makes that feel. Does that change the way it feels? Oh, yeah. Better or worse? It's worse when I go down. And then what we're going to do is we're going to double chest. You don't feel anything wrong with my spine, do no. you? No. Okay. But I always thought I have maybe a slip disc or something. Turn your head that way for me. You push out. Go. Yeah, keep your head there. Push out. Good. Turn your head the other way. Go. Good. And then go. Okay. I think you. you. All right, we're going to do this adjustment on you. Yeah, please. It's going to feel a little uncomfortable. Fine. I've been uncomfortable for many months. <laughs> you get in the way of your head. I'm going to drop you in position real briefly. <sighs> okay, it's going to do something. <sighs> My body wants to resist this right now. Oh, okay, good. You rest, I got you. We got it, right? That was solid. That was very directed. I love that. That's the adjustment I've been wanting to do on you for months. You know that, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> I've been holding out. You need to tell him how much he needs to keep on this. That area I've wanted cracked. There, there's a heavy sense of relief with that crack. I'm going to have you. In a little bit, get up, and we're gonna have you lift some weights. Okay. I want to make certain that that right arm doesn't have those. My body just. Yeah. Better? Yeah. Really? I mean, feel it. If I lay like this longer, it will, but. Not that same. No, you remember. Yeah. I would have been sitting up right now. Because I have really crazy. bad. I, I, I was able to do that just have, now. And I have really bad anxiety and stuff, so. Come you're not getting treated? Oh, the perfect I had no, I didn't know that, I didn't know it was so, like, detailed. I thought it was just if my neck hurt or if my back hurt. Did we check your balance yet? Uh, Cause, no. Because balance correlates with deficits in these areas that deal with anxiety. It makes sense, because when I get anxiety and stuff, I feel completely off balance and yeah. confused and disoriented. Yeah. Thing that is like just kind of a chronic condition, or? Yeah, we have, a lot of us have it. It's not unique. It's oh, not, okay. It's not like rare, right? I'll tell you, I have, I, I feel like I have strength. It's not like that point where I'm like, oh man, uh, this isn't normal. I feel like I've got strength here. Yeah, at, on the patio earlier before we came in, it was really bad. I mean, this one feels normal, but it feels like they can compete with each other. They feel almost equal. Yeah. When before it was like, so see how his chest is right now? How one side's a little, because he, he has a, a small dash of scoliosis. Okay. So there's a little curve in him, and that little curve makes it with the oh, lighting a little see. off. But you're unique and normal and that's... Uh, yeah, this would be the one that would relieve the, my shoulder one. That's crazy, dog. <laughs> that's crazy! Dude, I wasn't able to do that. A 10 pound weight? I couldn't even do that with, a, with my no, tool, this with, with like a my hammer. Process.
Ah! Oh, this nice. Lash on the gun. That was solid.